Hey guys, it's Kiki here and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be transforming Miss Lionel here into a frohawk. If you follow me on Instagram, you've been seeing a couple of posts with me and my frohawk. I love this style. It takes literally less than five minutes to do and it's just amazing. So I'm going to show you how I get that. So honestly, all I need, all you will need is three scrunchies. I use three scrunchies. Uh, you can use headbands. I don't think that's necessary because I will show you here. But my hair is in a stretch state. Uh, if you watched my previous video on how I got my hair this way, I used the Cream of Nature Honey Line products. And as you can see, the flakes did disappear as I mentioned in my last video. But this is her. She's in a semi-stretch state. I only put her in plaits probably every, it's been about two weeks now since I washed my hair. And I put my hair in plaits probably every four to five nights. I don't touch it, I just put my bonnet on, go to sleep, and fluff it out the next morning. So I try to keep my hair out of it, my hands out of my hair, but. So we're gonna get started. So I'm just gonna take my hand and finger part a section in the very back. You can use a regular, a comb. I don't think it's necessary. His finger parting. A large section in the back. Like so. I'm going to section this away. Section that part away, and now we're gonna just work on the back. So, you all know when you do a mohawk, there's, it kinda tapers off into a tail. The ponytail can do that, but I don't think it gets it as much as I would like. So, what I do is I take out a little section, like scoop it out. Take out a little section like this. I'm going to put the sides up. So it's a little section in the middle. Then I'm going to loop this scrunchie one time and separate it out. So voiceover Kiki is stepping in because I started getting too focused and I stopped talking. <laughs> but I'm just going to move up here and part from ear to ear with my fingers and I'm gonna do the same steps that I did on this back section here now your parts if you want them to be crispy by all means go for it but I don't think it's worth the time and possible <laughs> snap of my hair to do this because it's just a fro hog I'm not going for neatness I just want a cool looking dope fro hawk that's effortless. Now up here at the front on my last ponytail, I am going to scoop out another small section just like how I scooped it out in the back because that is gonna act as my little bang. So I'm leaving that aside for now and then I'm just gonna put this last section into a loose ponytail. Once you have your three ponytails, now you're just gonna fluff them out to your desired fluff. You can use more ponytails. I think three is quite enough for me, um, but you can use four or five, whatever you wanna do. But as you can see, it fills out very nicely with the loose scrunchies. And you can slick your baby hairs, do whatever you wanna do, but I chose not to. This is the way that I rock my fro hawk. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was super quick, super easy. It literally takes me less than five minutes to do this. But yes, let me know your thoughts. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Share this with your friends, family members, everyone. And also follow me on social media. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.